Have you ever contemplated the possibility of a disaster wiping out an entire species of plant or animal in an instant? That's a very real possibility, and preparation is key. So welcome to Interesting History. I hope you're all doing well. Today we are going to be going over the Svalbard Global Seed Vault. Strap in, and let's begin. On the Norwegian island known as Spittenberg, in the Svalbard archipelago, lies one of the biggest and most complete seed banks in the world. Built 120 meters inside a mountain of sandstone on the island. Chosen for its permafrost, a remote but still accessible location, a spot well above sea level to prevent flooding and humidity, and most importantly a lack of tectonic activity, the first stone was laid on June 19, 2006, and less than two years later, it was completed and opened on February 26, 2008. The mission of the seed vault is simple, to provide a fallback plan in case of mass loss of contents of gene banks scattered around the world, making easy recovery of samples if lost in accidents, financial or management problems, or equipment failures. All of these and more can be prevented with the Global Seed Vault. Early 2015, the vault added 218 types of tree seed to the storage facility, bringing the reported total to over 864,000 different kinds of seeds from over 4,000 entirely different species as of today. However, luckily, the vault has built to store 4.5 million seed samples at maximum capacity, so space is definitely not an issue. Costing a mere $9 million equivalent in U.S. currency, the importance of the seed vault makes it a very small price to pay for the survival of plant species around the world. As relief was just provided last year to a Syrian gene bank damaged in the war. Commonly and justifiably referred to as the Doomsday Vault, the Svalbard Global Seed Vault has the power to save food crop from the possibility of extinction and the 1,700 gene banks around the world can rest a little easier knowing that they always have a backup in times of disaster, a backup continuing to grow in inventory as days go by. Thank you so much for watching, and thanks for the continued support of the channel. Do you have a suggestion? Be sure to let me know, as I'm always open to them. Thanks again, and have a good night.